Hello and welcome back everybody. It's good to have you with us. We're going to start off like we have the last few lessons and write out our fives and our twos to practice it for multiplication. So I'm going to give you a minute. Go ahead and get your pencil or your marker ready. I want you to write out your fives all the way up to 100 and your twos up to 24. On your mark, get set, go. It wasn't quite done, let me finish. All right, here we go. Let's count our fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Nice job. Let's count our twos. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Nice job, everybody. Let's go ahead and erase that, and we'll chant our threes as we do. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24, score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. Speaking of threes, that's the next thing I'd like you to do. We're gonna, I'm going to give you 30 seconds to write out your threes up to 36. If you don't remember them, you can copy them off the board as I write them. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job, let's chant our threes. Three, six, nine, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and erase, let's chant. Three, six, nine, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Excellent job, everybody. Your brain's going to start to remember it now. All right, here we go. The next thing I'd like you to do is to write your numbers from 20 down to 0 backward. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. See if you can beat the timer. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Let's count that backwards together. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Nice job. Let's go ahead and erase that and we'll chant our threes as we do. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. All right, the next thing I'm going to do is write 
a few two-digit numbers on the board. I would like you to say them to yourself and write them in expanded form. I'm going to give you 30 seconds to do that. On your mark, get set, go. All right, let's say those numbers together. Can you read this number? 290. When we write that in expanded form, it's 200 plus 90. Nice job. Let's read this one. 483. Write that out. 400 80 plus 3 and check your work. Hopefully this is starting to make a lot of sense to you. You're doing so well. I'm going to go ahead and raise my board and chant my threes. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. All right, now here we're going to compare some numbers. I would like you to copy these numbers down and then you are going to go ahead and compare them. Here we go. All right, go ahead and write all those numbers down and we'll read them and compare them after this 30 seconds is up. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. You have about 10 seconds left. Nice job, here we go. This one is a three digit number. Let's read it, 290. This is a three digit number. Let's read it, 190. We have to look at the first number the 2 is bigger than the 1, so it would open up. 290 is greater than 190. Nice job. Even though these two are the same, the 90s, you always want to look at the biggest place value. And the biggest place value in both of these numbers are the hundreds. Alright, let's read this next one. It's a three digit number, 405. Three digit number? 396. We'll look at the hundreds place value. 4 is bigger than 3. So 405 is greater than 396. If you look at the tens, 9 is bigger than 0. If you look at the ones, 6 is bigger than 5. However, like I said before, you always look at the greatest place value. And the greatest place value in these numbers are the hundreds. All right, let's look at the next one. This is a three digit number, 561. This is a three digit number, 678. Look at the largest place value. Six is bigger than five. So we would say 561 is less than 678. Nice job, everybody. Let's go ahead and erase our board and chant our threes as we do it. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job, guys. All right. I'm going to write out a few numbers. There's going to be a few more this time. I'd like you to copy these down, and I'd like you to write the number it comes next after each of them. Okay? Now the reason why we're doing these is because this is going to help us count money. And you need to be able to switch over to the next number. So here we go. I'd like you to write the next number that comes after each one of these. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. On your mark, get set, go.
Okay, here we go. 45, 46, 60, 61, 75, 76, 30, 31, 55, 56, 80, 81. Nice job, everybody. Go ahead and check your work. I'm going to go ahead and erase my board, and we'll chant the threes again. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. The very next thing we're going to do is some adding. I'm going to give you three problems. I'd like you to go ahead and copy them down. And then I'm going to give you a whole minute to finish them up. Okay? All right. Almost done here. The first problem is 439 plus 186. 198 plus 206, then 453 plus 414. Go ahead and finish copying those down. I'm going to give you a minute to go ahead and add those. Just see how far you can get. On your mark, get set, go. Remember to circle the bigger number to count on the other one. And if it's a two-digit number, you have to regroup and carry. All right, nice job, everybody. If you're not finished, go ahead and finish. I'm going to go ahead and start working out the problems, and you can check your answer. I'm going to circle my 9, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 is a two-digit number, so I put down my 5. I regroup and carry my 1. Circle my 8, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 is a two-digit number, so I'll put down my 2. Regroup and carry my one. Circle my four, four, five, six. My answer is 625. Nice job. In the next problem, I'll circle my eight, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 is a two digit number. I'll put down my four, I'll regroup and carry my one. Circle my nine, nine, 10. Put down my zero, it's a two digit number. I'll regroup and carry, put my one up there, circle my two, two, three, four. My answer is 404. Nice job. This next one, I'll circle my four, four, five, six, seven. I don't need to regroup because it's not a two-digit number. I'll circle my five, five, six. Put down my six. Here I have four plus four. I want to circle the number on top, four, Six, seven, eight. My answer is 867. Nice job, everybody. Go ahead and check your work. If you got them correct, nice job. If you didn't, we'll just keep practicing. That's okay. I'm going to go ahead and erase my board, and I'm going to chant my threes to practice. To get ready for our next thing. You ready? 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24 score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. All right, go ahead and get your pencil or your marker ready. We're going to go ahead and do some subtraction. I'm going to give you three problems, and I'm going to have you copy them and go ahead and figure them out. Okay? All right. We've got 48 minus 17. 91 minus 38, 
and 56 minus 27. I'm going to go ahead and set my alarm for a minute. I'd like you to go ahead and answer those problems. Do the best you can. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. You have about 30 seconds. <whistles> nice job, here we go. In this first one, I'll circle my eight, count Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Here I'll circle my four, four, three. My answer is 31. Here I'm going to circle my eight because it's bigger than one. Eight is on the bottom. Big number on the bottom. I have to borrow. Big bottom borrow. I have to put a one in front of the one to make it bigger. It makes it an 11. I cross off the nine because I took the one from that. So now I have 11 minus 8. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Here I'm going to circle my 8 because that's my biggest number. 8, 7, 6, 5. My answer is 53. Here I'm going to circle my big number, which is 7. It, the, 7 is a big number on the bottom, so we have to borrow. Big bottom borrow. I'm going to make 6 a 16. I'm going to cross off my 5 and make it a 4. 16 minus 7, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. Now I'm going to circle my big number here, 4, 3, 2. My answer is 29. Nice job. I'm going to erase it and chant my 3s. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18, 21, 24, score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. Nice job. The very next thing we're going to do is work on our multiplication. So here is your next problem. I have 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. All right. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. I'd like you to write out the multiplication problem, the array, and a picture. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. All right, our number that we're going to write down first is a 3. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 3 times 6. I'm going to circle the number I know. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 more. 18. I'm going to draw an array. I'm going to have 3 rows. I'm going to have 6 in each row. When you do the array, you should make sure that you line your dots up so it's easier to keep track. And when I draw a picture, I'm going to have three groups with six in each. All right, go ahead and check your answer. I'm going to erase this. We're going to do one more. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen more. 18, 21, 24, score. 27, 30, almost done. 33, 36, counting threes is fun. All right, here we go. We're going to keep working with our threes. And I'm going to give you another 30 seconds to write out the multiplication problem, the array, 
and the picture. All right, here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. All right, the first number we're going to write down is three. We're going to count our threes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three times nine. I'm going to circle my three because that's the number I know how to count by. And then I'm going to count on my nine. But I only touch it every time that I say a number. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen more. Eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four score. Twenty-seven. All right, we're going to make three rows with nine in each. Three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's important that you double check that, okay? Because that's what makes a raise so hard because it's hard to pay attention to all the details. I have three groups. I put nine in each group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, not nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nice job, everybody. All right, we've got one more thing we're going to do. I'm going to give you a set of multiplication problems for you to go ahead and write down and solve. We'll do that as soon as I erase all this. All right, go ahead and Copy these down. You're going to have six problems, and I'm going to give you 30 seconds to do them. All right, keep going. I need my equal sign. All right, here we go. I'm going to give you 30 seconds to answer as many of those as you can. If you get all of them right, that's great. If you miss a few or you don't finish, that's okay. We are just practicing. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. You have 30 seconds. Nice job. All right, let's solve these together. Circle my five because I can count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Here, I'm going to circle my two because I know how to count by two. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. Here, they're both threes, so it doesn't matter which one I pick because I know how to count by threes, but you should always pick the first one, three. Three, six, nine. Here I'm going to circle my three and count on my seven. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen more. Eighteen, twenty-one. Remember, I only touch when I say a number. Circle my five. Ten, fifteen, twenty. I'm going to circle my two. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. There you have it. Go ahead and check your work. Hopefully this is starting to get a little easier for you. I'm so proud of how hard you work today. Thank you so much for your attention. As always, there's extra practice after the video, and we will see you next time. Thank you.